how to import grades from Google Classroom into Facts. So as you can see right now, I am in Google Classroom and I have an assignment pulled up. And you'll notice that I do have a due date and a due time. This assignment was due at 10, 10 a.m. today. So that's why the date is not showing, but you could see there's my due date, there's my due time. This will be important in a moment. And I'm going to save my assignment here in Google Classroom. And once you save an assignment in Google Classroom, whether it be a live assignment or a draft, you can go into Facts, and I am going to click on Create an Assignment. I'm going to select my grade category. This is a homework, so I'll select it as a homework. And then I'm going to scroll down, and all the way at the bottom of this dialog box is a box that says Google Classroom. I'm going to click that, and when I do, a new box pops up. I'm going to select this drop down menu, and the assignment I was just looking at is 2.1 homework. I'm going to select that assignment. I'm going to load the assignment details from Google Classroom, which is important, and I'm going to press OK. And you'll notice that whenever I selected that, it automatically updated my due date to September 12th, 2023 at 10 a.m. If you wanted, and then you'll also see that the assignment details, the page number and problem numbers that I had associated with that assignment also loaded. If I wanted to change this or completely remove it, I could. I'm going to leave it for now, and I'm going to press save and close. So now this assignment is showing up in my facts gradebook screen, and I'm going to go back to Google Classroom. For this assignment, I have already graded it, so I've released the grades in Google Classroom, which is the first step. If you were to use a Google Form, you would want to import your grades, but otherwise you would want to make sure that you have graded student work at this point in time. Since I already have graded student work for this assignment in Google Classroom, I can go back to Facts, and I can do this in one of two ways. The first way I can do this is by selecting Load Google Grades here in this top row. I'm going to select that. And in this menu, I'm going to click on the checkbox next to the 2.1 homework. I'll press Load. And automatically, all the grades that I have already input into Google Classroom have transferred over without any extra effort. Another way that you could load the Google Grades is you can click on the assignment itself and then you can select Load Google Grades from here. You may not see it happen right now, but it did. It would have uploaded it. You can see it better if you, sw if you switch over to this Grades menu and again, pressing it. Nothing will change because it's the same information that I've already loaded. But if I had grades for the students who hadn't yet turned in an assignment, then those grades would show up once they had been returned in Google Classroom. I'm going to close this. One important thing to note here is that whenever you are importing an assignment from Google Classroom, especially if you're using a Google Form, is that you need to be sure that the point value is 100 points because if it's not 100 points for your Google Forms assignment, it is going to be a very literal interpretation when you do this upload process. So say you had a Google Forms assignment that was only worth 25 points and a student got 25 out of 25 points, which is a 100, this, in fact, would only show up as 25 instead of a 100. So you would have to make that adjustment on the back end, which is an extra step and a little bit of extra math, but the process would still work the same way. Hopefully this helps you.